Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Metal Gear Solid. Last time we had a throwdown with what is known as Gray Fox. Apparently he's a human guy who, or like I say, he's a ninja cyborg thing who used to be human or something like that. I don't know. I guess he was friends with Snake at some point. But anyways, and we also had a long conversation with Dr. Hal Emmerich, who is the creator of Metal Gear Rex. And we can now call him on our thing, which, oh my god, I don't think I remember what his frequency is. Shit. Well, hopefully he calls us. I forgot to look up the frequency in the last video. Oh well, hopefully we don't need to call him in this episode. We should be fine. I'll just do some exploration in this episode. Now that we have the level 4 key card, which I also obtained from Mr. Emmerich, we should be able to go to a few different places. Because I remember we crossed a lot of level 4 doors coming through these areas so far. So let's head our ass back the way we came and see what we can find. We're going to have to grab that gas mask once we get back out here, I'm, I'm guessing. Because if I recall, yep, this room is still covered in gas masks. I mean, it's not covered in gas masks. It's covered in gas, which requires a mask to survive. All right. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. I was just about to say, I got to keep an eye out for those fucking guns, which I did not do a very good job of. For some reason, I didn't realize there was one right next to me. Fucking brilliant I am. All right. Let it go back to green so it'll start panning. And then run, run, run as fast as you can. You can't shoot me. I'm the gingerbread man. All right. So let's try and explore this room a little bit. Try to explore this room for a little bit. Get around them guns like a little bit. Like a beast mode. Beast, beast mode. I want to get in that door. What level is that door? It's level six. I don't think we're going in that door anytime soon. What about you? Level three? I'm in. I like how the gas mask is right next to the level whatever card. So that way you can switch back to it real quick. Anyway. I just want to explore, man. What I mean... There's no reason not to explore. What, Really, though, what reason is there not to? It's good to so you can see what kind of items there are. There might be some new equipment I can find. There might be new something. Might be required stuff. You never know. Like, look, I just got some more missiles for my, my guided missile launcher. Who wouldn't want that? Getting useful-ass items. Yeah, did I mean? Just got to keep an eye on my, my little life bar. Whether or not I'm going to start choking to death. Can I open this door too? Yes, I can. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? Night vision goggles. Didn't I already have night vision goggles? I feel like I already had those. Huh, maybe not. I know I had heat vision. Maybe I didn't have night vision. Anyway. What else we got around here? Anything else good? More grenades and an extra ration. Cool, so I maxed out on rations. Good, 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 good. And can we bust out this window? Wouldn't that be cool? We could just bust this window open. Just punch it open like a fucking beast. Anyways, alright, so I guess we're done here on this floor. Shit, watch out for the guns. Okay, I haven't gotten to where the guns are yet. Be careful. I don't want to get fucked up by those guns. Just prepare to run when the gun stops looking. Alright, we're good, we're good. Alright, and we checked all these rooms, I'm pretty sure. Because one had the gas mask, and well, let's double check the levels of the doors. This one's level four. Actually, I don't think I went in there, now that I think about it. I definitely went in there. I don't think I went in here because I didn't have the level four card yet. So let's take a gander in here. What do we got? More stun grenades, more stun grenades, more useless shit. Sounds useless to me. All right, anything, what level is this door? Level one, okay, I definitely went in there before. And, I don't know, wait, did I go in there? I guess it wouldn't hurt to check. Just take a qu real quick look. Ah, get that mask on. All right, yeah, I definitely went in here. All right, we're almost done, though. Let's get the fuck out of here before we die. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. All right, whew, I was close, I was close. Lost half my health on that, but that's all good. It's all good. We're, we're safe. Safe in town. All right, so let's head... Where, okay, did, did they say where I need to go? Actually, if I recall correctly, Mr. Doctor Whatever said something about the, uh, we gotta find Meryl, right? And he said something about a room that only women can go into. That's basically what he implied. I'm, I'm trying to remember the conversation I had with that guy. It was pretty long, and I, ha and I, I haven't played since Friday. 
But I think I recall there being a conversation that had something that went along those lines. And guess what? Uh, a place that only women can go. Well, should we go to the uh, state the obvious? The restroom? The women's restroom? Wait, how do we get in the women's restroom, though? It doesn't open for us. It probably can tell our gender just by looking at us. Huh. Well, that doesn't help me. Now, does it? Well, let's go in the bathroom. Maybe we can... Maybe there's a vent. There's a level 5 door back here, which I already knew about. Oh, great. And there's a guy about to come out the bathroom. Oh, no. He's washing his hands. Quick. Ah. Shit. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Shit. Um. Ah, shit. I was gonna choke. Oh, fuck. Shit. Uh, run, run, run. Shit. Fuck, run. Run, you fool. Run. I don't know where to go. There's, like, nowhere to run. It's like, actually get out of fucking harm's way. Oh, shit. Um, I don't know where to run. There's, like, nowhere to hide around this floor. Just look out for those fools on the map, I guess. Bust out my fucking card. See if we can open one of these damn doors to hide inside of... Ah! Ah, I'm dying. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Shit. Uh, get my rations out. Get my fucking famous out. And let's go. You don't want none? You don't want none? Ah, shit. I'm gonna use up all my damn rations. Can we please aim? You know what I need to do is stop using my damn D-pad like that's gonna help. And something tells me you can't just shoot all the enemies to death and survive. Shit. What the hell, man? Can you seriously not just kill all the enemies? They just keep on coming forever? Or did they actually stop coming now? Fuck, I killed like six of them. That's kind of lame that you can't just kill all the enemies and then stop it. I mean, I guess it'd be a cheap way to get through the game, but seriously, what the hell, man? Why even have the option of shooting guards and killing them if you can't actually kill them all and not be, like, in danger anymore, you know what I mean? I don't know, I just don't see the point. Alright, that room we've been in before, I think. Let's see, have we been in this room? This one's level 4, so that's a no. What do we got in here? Some more SOCOM bullets. There's another ration, which I was in dire need of now that I used all my damn rations. Fighting guards, like a fucking noob. And did I check all the doors on this side? Let's double check. God damn it, there's a guy in here again. Whatever, just go around. He, he's a fucking idiot. He doesn't know where the hell, what the hell he's patrolling. He can't patrol for shit. Worst patroller ever. Alright, he's going that way, so let's... Ah, fuck. God damn it. All I was trying to do is grab the damn... Ugh. Wait, where the fuck did he go? Wait, was he scared of me? Wait, what? That was so weird. Did he, like, run away from me or something? That was strange. I feel like he ran away. Wait, he ran into the other bathroom? Holy crap. Is that how you get in here? Oh! Oh! I already get it. It's what's-her-face. It's her. What the heck? Did I figure this out, like, accidentally? What the fuck? That's the second time I've been able to sneak that up is on pretty the awesome. I can't believe that was accidentally figured out. Wow. Amazing. You're Meryl. There's no way you could pass for a man for long. What do you mean? Hey, men aren't allowed in here. I had no idea you were so feminine. This is no time to try and hit on me, Snake. You knew she was feminine. You watched her walk away. You were watching that ass. Don't even try to pretend you weren't. Besides, it's a waste of time. When I joined up, they gave me psychotherapy to destroy my interest in men. Liar. Same smart mouth. You're Meryl, all right. Are you hurt? Not yet. After all, I was disguised as a genome soldier. So why'd you change? You'd be a lot better off dressed like one of them. I got tired of disguising myself. The truth is, the uniform smelled like blood. Ooh, nice tat. Mark? Huh? Oh, this? It's a paint tattoo. It's not real. I was a fan of Foxhound way back, when guys like you and my uncle were in it. 
None of that gene therapy like there is today. You guys were real heroes. There are no heroes in war. All the heroes I know are either dead or in prison. One or the other. But Snake, you're a hero, aren't you? I'm just a man who's good at what he does. Killing. There's no winning or losing for a mercenary. The only winners in war are the people. That's right, and you fight for the people. I've never fought for anyone but myself. I've got no purpose in life, no ultimate goal. Come on. It's only when I'm cheating death on the battlefield. The only time I feel truly alive. Seeing other people die makes you feel alive, huh? You love war and don't want it to stop? Is it the same with all great soldiers throughout history? Pretty much. Why didn't you contact me? My codec was broken. Is that all? Should Liar. Should we just be happy we met up like this? How did you recognize me in disguise? I never forget a lady. <laughs> so, there's something you like about me, huh? Yeah, you've got a great butt. Oh, he just had oh, to say it too. First it's my eyes, now it's my butt. What's next? On the battlefield, you never think about what's next. Well, at least the dialogue is realistic. That's probably what I'm enjoying about so this game Smith, the most. How are the negotiations going? No progress. So it's all up to you, huh? Somebody's got to stop them from launching a nuclear missile. There are two ways. Either we destroy Metal Gear or... We override the detonation code. You got the card keys from Baker? Card keys? You mean this? Where are the others? There should be three keys. This is all I've got. Where could the other two be? I have no idea, but they must be somewhere. If we can't find them, we'll have no choice but to destroy Metal Gear. Metal Gear is in an underground maintenance base to the north. Take me too. I know this place better than you do. You'll just slow me down. You don't have enough battle experience. I won't slow you down. I promise. And what if you do? Then you can shoot me. <laughs> I don't like to waste bullets. <laughs> he doesn't like Bye. wasting bullets on on that ass. Be careful. So no, she actually going to follow us around? That'd be kind of cool. I hardly ever look at myself in the mirror. I've always despised that kind of woman. I always dreamed of becoming a soldier. But I was wrong. It wasn't really my dream. My father. He was killed in action when I was younger. You wanted to follow in your father's footsteps? Not really. I thought that if I became a soldier, I could understand him better. So are you a soldier yet? I thought I was until today, but now I understand. The truth is, I was just afraid of looking at myself, afraid of having to make my own decisions in life. But I'm not going to lie to myself anymore. It's time I took a long, hard look at myself. I want to know who I am, what I'm capable of. I want to know why I've lived the way I've lived until now. I want to know. Take a good look. You won't I want to know. Life. You should wash your face, too, while you're at it. Yeah. This isn't a training exercise. Our lives are Oh, she was crying the whole time? There are no heroes or heroines. If you lose, you're worm food. Yeah. You don't cry in front of a solid snake. Is functional? Unfortunately, it's out of ammo. Oh, I got Did some ammo for you, baby. I found it in the armory. It's a 50 caliber Action Express. There was a SOCOM pistol, too, but I chose this. Huh. So I got a leftover, huh? Isn't that gun a little big for a girl? Don't worry. I can handle it. Come on. Use my 45. Listen, I've used a gun like this since I was eight years old. I'm more comfortable with it than I am with a bra. Ooh. <laughs> and she puts her air rounds into her bra, too, yeah. If we're gonna go to the north, we'll have to go... Wow, to the only detail on her whole body. Door. Nipples. The overland route is blocked by glaciers. The door to the commander's room is security level five. This card will open it. Bam! Level five it was card, like nothing. The uniform I was wearing. Looks like he must have been guarding someplace important. Only one more level card to get, and we'll be able to open any door. I think level six, I think, is the highest I've seen. Okay, let's go. I know this place better than you. You already said that, I'll bitch. Be point man. Follow me. Oh, we actually have to follow her. Okay, interesting. Let's bust out the. The uh, SOCOM, not that, the SOCOM, and let's keep our rations ready just in case. Since she has, the, wait, did she give us the level 5 card? She did, so we can actually look around if we want, and we can see where she took her clothes off. Haha, <laughs> funny. Well, that was cool. Kind of cool That's how they set strange. this up. There's no guard. Bitch, we already killed all the guards. I'll keep a lookout. 
Make sure you're ready, okay? What happened to the music? You mean the music? They could hear the music while you're playing the game? It wasn't just like part of the fucking background of just like of the game. It was actually a thing that was like real. Anyway, there's a level five door in here, wasn't there? In here, what do we got? Another ration. Wait, what? Diaz Pam. What's a da Diaz Pam? What is this? Anti anxiety drug. Temporary stops involuntary trembling. Huh. I don't even know what that is. Guess we'll have to find out. Diazepam, 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 dub 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 scuba. What's this room? Cardboard box B. Oh yeah, we got another cardboard box. Ooh, now I bet you we can give that to Meryl, and then we can be cardboard box buddies. Cardboard box buddies. <laughs> Sounds sexual. I want you to be my card box buddy. Cardboard box buddy. Cardboard box buddy. I'm just looking to see if there's any new rations that have respawned because I could use another ration. I guess not. Oh well. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Let's follow Meryl to wherever we're supposed to go. It's probably going to be that back door over there. Didn't she say follow me and yet she's the one just standing there? Whatever. Let's go head over here and see what's in this room. This is probably where we're supposed to go. I do recall being at least a couple level 5 doors somewhere back where I've already been. But if there are places that I need to go back to on my own time, you guys can just let me know. But if it's if I'm if I'm going to be led back to old areas at some point on as the game progresses, then don't worry about it. But anyways, let's check out what's behind door number 5. Oh, it hurts. What's wrong? Don't come here, Snake. Don't come here, Snake. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Bet you it's that mantis fool. It's that psycho mantis fool, isn't it? The one that's like does okay? like fucking psychical powers and shit. What happened? She dying? I'm fine. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. Let's go. Mind control. She's not the same. Where's she going? Come on, Mr. Foxhound. The commander is waiting. I knew it. She's being controlled. I fucking knew it. She's acting strange. Great. Wait, commander's waiting. I would look out behind you if I was you, Snake. But that's just me. Wait, what the heck? Am I her? Oh, I was controlling her for a second there. That was weird. Yeah, see? She's being controlled. I knew it. I could tell. I could tell. Snake. Watch out, snake! <gasps> Behind you! Like what the? Do you like me? I only like that ass. Snake. What's wrong? Uh, oh, hurry, hurry. Make I love to me. That's not really a good way to to. Uh... Oh, sorry. So that's not really a good way to be. Um, sexy, sexy. Not herself. Yeah. Don't use your weapon. No shit. It's Psycho Mantis. He's controlling Meryl. That tune is his mind control music. Duh. Don't use your weapon. Try to knock her out. Enough said. Try to knock a bitch out. Time to punch a bitch out. Like, I mean, we got good at this last episode, so why not? Bam, bitch. Punch a Meryl. What are you gonna do, Psycho Mantis? You don't want none. Are we supposed to like kick her ass? Like literally? We just like choke her. Snake. Yeah, there we go. Just choke her ass out. I did the right thing, right? That's what. Oh, I did it wrong. Snake. Fuck. Snake. I didn't know I was spo wasn't supposed to choke her out. I thought I was supposed to fucking. My bad. Damn it. I was kind of hoping for an episode where I just didn't get any game overs. It's doing so well. Well, let's see. I could skip all that, right? Wait. Um. Yeah, okay. I still have my DAs, a palm, or whatever. I was just making sure I didn't... I don't have to go back and get that shit I had a minute ago. Anyway, let's head back in there, and we'll skip all the scenes this time, because that was lame. I think it was pretty obvious that it was Psycho Mantis. We've been seeing hints of him since I got in this damn place. So, I'm still trying to decide whether he's the reason why all these people okay? were dying, 
or if Snake was the reason. But I feel like it would be more more of a surprise if Snake is the one that is accidentally killing all these people that are dying. Wouldn't it be more interesting that way? I think it would be. Let me get my rations ready. Um, is there anything useful in here? Wait, how come she's not, like, attacking me? How did I trigger that? I was, like, looking around with first-person view. Well, I guess it just triggers after a certain amount of time. Anyway, let's skip this shit if we can. Can we not skip this? Oh, come on. Let me skip it. Thank you. I already know. She's not herself. Kick her ass. All right, I'm just going to punch her. Unless we're supposed to shoot him while we're punching her out. But I guess we're not supposed to choke her because I, I, I guess I snapped her neck. Unless I'm supposed to, like... Okay, never mind. I knocked her out. Cool, cool. All right. I was about to say, am I supposed to, like, attack the the sh the silhouette of douchebag over here? I hope that's not your only trick. Of course I do. You're just a bitch-ass psychic. You can't fight me one-on-one. -on -one. I'll show you why I am the most powerful practitioner of psychokinesis and telepathy in the world. Oh, shit. He's going to start throwing shit at me, isn't he? There's no need for words, Snake. I'm psychomatis. I think I learned that already. This is no trick. It's true power. It's useless, I told you. I can read your every thought. Oh, yeah? Now, let me read your mind. No, perhaps I should say your past. You're a careless man, aren't you? And you're a poor warrior as well. However, you are skillful at eluding traps. Of course. I'm a snake, Biatch. believe me. Now I'll read more deeply. Ooh, this might be interesting. Let's see what he has to say about my soul. I can see into your mind. So, you like Suikoden. What the fuck? What the fuck? Is he looking into the memory card? You have not said it often. <laughs> this is actually kind of cool. He actually looks at stuff we've done in the game. That's awesome. Oh my god. That's fucking awesome. I will show you my psychokinetic power. Put your controller on the floor. Put it down as flat as you can. That's good. Now I will move your controller by the power of my will alone. <laughs> That's awesome. It's actually rumbling in my hands as he's doing it. That's fucking cool. I like how they integrated this. This is fucking cool. A demonstration. It's over. It wasn't much of a demonstration, but it was cool. I'm not going to lie. Oh, now we get to fight. Oh, what the fuck? Cheater. Cheater. He's doing stuff to my screen. Stop it. Stop it. I knew it. I knew it. It's fucking... He's messing with my mind. Bastard. Cut it out. Um, shit, I don't know. I don't know how we're going to do this. I don't know if we have to shoot him or what. I'm a little bit um, at a loss for words on what we're supposed to do here. I'm just firing bullets like a madman right now. I'm not sure with what to do. Hitting me with fucking furniture and shit. Are we supposed to punch him maybe? Uh, maybe. Oh, maybe we gotta hit him with like a stun grenade. Maybe that'll work. I got him. I hit him with one thing. Okay, stun grenade not exactly working like I hoped. Uh, let's try a chaff grenade, maybe? That's not going to help. Uh, what else do I have? What else do I have? What else do I have? All I have is stun grenades and chaff grenades. I have regular grenades. Throw those at him. Oh, shit. That kind of hit him. Damn it. trying to figure out what the hell I'm supposed to hit him with. They, they're giving me SOCOM bullets, so I should probably be able to shoot him. I just, I, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do to hit him. Oh, 
God, stop that shit, Hideo. Hideo. Okay, I'm supposed to press something, I guess. God damn it. Could you quit shooting me? Or throwing shit at me, I mean. I'm just not sure what I should do to hit him. Am I just supposed to dodge and, like, stick and move, stick and move type of thing? Maybe we should just try the Famous. Let's try it. Where'd he go? God damn it. God damn it. God damn it, and he just killed me, didn't he? Son of a bitch. I'll just meet you back when I'm fighting the battle, so I don't have to go through all that cutscene shit again. Alright, back to the battle. Fuck you, Hideo. Hideo bitch. Ah, uh, hide Joe bitch right now, Hideo Kojima bitch. How long does this last, usually? Alright, I just gotta be careful. And I guess I could just... I guess you just gotta... There's gotta be, like, a fucking... Like, a pattern here. And I'm thinking it might have something to do with this Diazapom shit. I feel like trying it. How do I use it, though? Do I press circle? I do. I don't know if that's actually gonna help, but we'll find out, won't we? Um, where'd he go? Where'd that bitch go? Where'd you go, bitch? How am I supposed to hit him? I don't get it. Um... There's got to be, like, a pattern to follow here. There has to be. There always is. When he's using that shit, do we just throw fucking grenades at him? I, I'm not sure. Get up, fool. Get up, you fool. Pick up that ration, you fool. Ah. Damn it, I blew myself up with that. Uh. What can be used here? Mine detector, ammo disc, cigarettes, magnifying scope, cardboard box, night vision goggles, thermal goggles, gas mask. None of that shit seems useful so useful to me here. The only thing that seems like I can do anything is freaking... Can we, can we hit him with this shit? <laughs> Trying to shoot a fucking rocket launcher at him, that's funny. Got him. Kicked him in his face. Damn, I feel like this is easy to do. I just, I have to get used to this. Cut it out with your damn Hideo Kojima vision. Cut it out. Man, I might have to skip to, like, me figuring this out. Because seriously, this is disappointing. I just can't, I can't, like, get a feel for this battle, you know? You know what I'm saying? Like, he's just, uh, ah! Oh! God, I can't, like, see where he is. I feel like I can't hit him when he's doing that shit. I, fa I can't blow that shit up. I just have to move the fuck out of the way. Oh, watch out for them chairs. Like, I should be waiting for him to get in, like, a certain position to hit him. But then he always runs away like a little bitch. If he could read my mind, there's got to be, like, a way to avoid it. <sighs> this is fucking irritating as shit. Oh, my God. Stop that, fuck. I get, like, a kick in every once in a while, but it, it's, like, it's hard to fucking hit him. There's got to be a way. Stun grenade work. No, not chaff grenade. Stun grenade. Oh my god, I can't even see. Fucking chaff grenade went insane. Did I do did I hit myself? Is that the problem? I did. I fucking hit myself with that shit. <sighs> Fucker, I can't even see him. It's not fair. There's gotta be a way. There's gotta be something I'm just not picking up on here. There's something I'm not picking up on. I just don't know what it is. I'm not even kidding. I just... I, I, I don't know. It's not... It's not that. Ah! 
I don't know. I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know. I guess I'll just meet you when I figure out a good way to kill this fucker. This is bitch. This is bullshit ass bullshit. Okay. Uh, the colonel's calling me during the battle. Use the controller port. Plug your controller into controller port two. Oh, that, holy balls! Are you kidding me? That's how you do it? Okay. What the fuck? Seriously? They actually have you plug the fucking controller into another port? This game is fucking amazing. How? Why? Just why is this game a game I never got into, man? It's so fucking clever. And it's use of different things. It's fucking clever. So what, now I can just shoot him like a fucking beast? Get up, snake. It's time to fuck this fool up. Get up! Get up! I was hoping somebody would call me and let me know how to fight this fool. Alright, wait. Let's get the fuck up and try to get this fool cracking. Oh, he can't. He can't read my shit anymore, bitch. Oh, we're famishing him. We're, oh, you're so famished. You're so famished. Alright, let's back the fuck up so we can get by these damn chairs. Let's fire away. I should probably use the SOCOM because uh, it kind of aims for me. It's got that laser sight. Fucking bullshit. Bitch. But well, now we can just shoot him willy nilly and punch him and shit, huh? Hell yeah, we can. We just gotta watch the fuck out for his shit. We're probably gonna lose this at least one more time because I'm not being careful now that I. Now that I can hit him, though. Uh, now that I know how to hurt this fool, this shit is game over. I'm, I'm more worried now that the battle's just gonna get harder, that's all. Which it might. Shit, the riding one got a little bit harder as time went. <sighs> Come on. God damn it, stop with your damn Hideo Kojima vision. I do think that that is very clever that they did the Hideo, that he used his name because it, it rhymes with video. And most people's TVs have a mode where it goes to video like that. I think that's pretty clever how they used his name like that in, in America smart move. I doubt it works out exactly the same way in Japan or maybe not. I don't know. I think the word video is pretty universal though, isn't it? Like, I know in Spanish vid video is just video, you know? So, I guess. Shoot that psycho bitch. Why am I not hitting him? Watch out for the statue. I saw it coming. I saw it coming. Can he stop fucking... Yeah, there you go. Run. Okay, I'm out of Famous Bullets. I mean, SOCOM Bullets. Time for some Famous Bullets. I probably can... As I, the, the, the ammo usually resets the longer you take. I'm more concerned that I'm not going to live. Now, the Famous actually have to aim, so... Just keep shooting. Oh, fuck. Whew. Got a duck. Got to learn how to duck from those fucking things. I wish this had more of a top view camera angle. I don't like the camera angle for this boss fight too much. Unless there's a way to like... Oh shit, get the fuck up! Get the fuck up! I didn't want to be... Ugh. Snake, I didn't tell you to go face down on the ground. I didn't realize the other joystick was the equivalent to using certain buttons. It's like the C stick on the GameCube controller. It actually uses the different C buttons if you use the other joystick. Anyway, let's just fire our other two bullets so we can reload. We got him halfway dead though. I almost feel like I should fast forward the rest of this fight so it doesn't take so damn long. Oh, got him halfway dead. Maybe he'll run away. Why couldn't you read my mind? Because I'm a fucking beast. I'm a dog. I'm a motherfucking problem. Oh, and well now we got to knock Meryl out again? God damn it. Probably without killing her, too. God damn it. Quit shooting me, bitch. Now shoot him. Okay, we knocked her out again. That's good. You are powerful indeed, but I know your weak point. And what is that? Meryl, stand right where he can see you and blow your brains out. Oh shit, she's gonna kill herself. Stop, Meryl! No, Meryl! No, yeah, I knocked her ass out again. <laughs> now what, bitch? Bring it, psycho bitch. I don't have any more fucking uh, rations, so I gotta be careful. Well, whatever. If I lose again, I'll just get back to this point in the fight. Just keep running around, trying not to get hit. Come on, you psycho bitch. God damn it, you fuck. Get up. Get up, snake. 
can't can find him. He keeps popping up where I'm not. Bitch. Come on. Where you going? Oh, you bitch! He keeps clipping me before I don't see him. He's a cheater. He's a goddamn cheater. That's what he is. Oh my god, I can't dive out of the way, man. This isn't like Call of Duty. not Call of Duty, but it isn't like fucking... I don't know. Gears of War or something where I can just dive the fuck out of the way. Could it cut that shit out, you psycho whore. Oh my god. I, he's a fucking cheater. That's all I can say. I can't... He doesn't stick around long enough for me to shoot him. Man, I'm gonna have to do this all over again, aren't I? God damn it. This is lame. You have to hit him, like, right when he pops up. And get the f*** out the way, because he throws that shit like a fucking crazy man. Get the- Oh, you fuck! God damn it. I'll meet you back at this point in the fight, because that was- Ugh! That fight takes forever. Oh my god. I can't believe I got all the way to this point again and died again. Fuck my life. I guess I have to show this death. Son of a bitch. Ah! Lame. Just kill me. Just kill me, please. That's another death. That one was stupider because I killed myself with grenades. Alright, we got him. We got him in this last stage. He's gonna start throwing shit at me again, but I think I got him. Come on. Come on. Just gotta dodge some fucking things. Shoot him in his face some more and he should be done for. Yes! Fuck you! Headshot, bitch. Did we actually kill him? No fucking way. Let's find out. Dino, your niece is going to be okay. Thanks, Snake. I owe you one. Now that Mantis is beaten, Meryl's brainwashing should wear off, right, Naomi? Yes. It should. But why did you go so far out of your way to save her? Because she's got that ass. Sake, maybe it's because you like her. Duh. I don't want to see any woman die right in front of me. Oh, really? Since when did anybody's death bother you so much? Naomi, it's true that Snake has killed a lot of people. But that doesn't mean he doesn't have a heart. It's okay, Colonel. She's right. Don't be hating. Let me guess, we're going to get a ten minute cutscene now, too. I wasn't able to read the future. A strong man doesn't need to read the future. He makes his own. <laughs> Perhaps so. But I'll read your future. <laughs> to get to Metal Gear's underground maintenance base, you have to go through that hidden door. Okay then. Why are you telling me? Yeah, this? that's a good question. I was thinking I that myself. People's minds. In my lifetime, I have read the past, presents, and futures of thousands upon thousands of men and women. Oh, gross. What is he, a leper or something? Each mind that I peered into was stuck. With the same Don't show his face. You can't even. Obsession. You won't even be able to see it. It's gonna be all pixelated in PlayStation fucking. Desire to pass on one seed. It was enough to make me sick. Every living thing on this planet exists to mindlessly pass on their DNA. We're designed that way, and that's why there is war. Of course. But you, you are different. Not really. The same as us. We have no past, no future. We live in the moment. That's our only purpose. Living in the moment. Humans weren't designed to bring each other happiness. From the moment we're thrown into this world, 
We're fated to bring each other nothing but pain and misery. The first person whose mind I dove into was my father's. I saw nothing but disgust and hatred for me in his heart. My mother died in childbirth. Fathers always blame he the child when the right. father dies. I mean, when the mother dies in childbirth. My father was going to kill me. Always blaming that kid. That's when my future disappeared. I lost my past as well. When I came to, the village was engulfed in flames. Are you saying that you burned your village down to bury your past? I see that you have suffered the same trauma. <laughs> We are truly the same, you and I. Not exactly, I'm sure. But in some ways, I'm sure. People like you in it. I never agreed with the boss's revolution. His dreams of world conquest do not interest me. I just wanted an excuse to kill as many people as I could. You monster. Let him talk. He doesn't have much time left. I've seen through evil. You, Snake. You're just like the boss. No, you're worse. Compared to you, I'm not so bad. <laughs> I read her mind as well. Meryl's? I saw you there. You have a large place in your heart. A large place? A large place? <laughs> a large place. <laughs> Good words. Good words. Just lie together. I have a last request. What is it? My mask. Put it back on. Okay. Like this. Other people's thoughts force their way into my mind before I die. I want to be by myself. Fair I enough. I want to be left alone in my own world. <laughs> I'll open the door for you. If you want to find your future, go through that door. Okay. Secret doors. Secret passages. This is the first time I've ever used my power to help someone. It's strange. Not entirely it's true. Kind of nice. And dead. Right when he feels nice for the first time ever. I guess that's our first member of Foxhound that we've actually got to kill. The other Let's two that go, we fought Meryl. ran away like little bitches. I'm sorry. Meryl? How could I let Mantis control my mind like that? Because you're a feeble woman? If you're going to doubt yourself, <laughs> I'll leave you here. You're right. Never doubt yourself. Just let it make you stronger. Learn something from it. Yeah, you got to be right. stronger than yesterday. I won't do it again. Snake, can I ask you something? What? About what Mantis said. I was just wondering. What? What's the problem now? What's oh, this large no. place he was talking about? Is it in your pants, oh, Snake? Me, Snake? Ha ha ha. What's your name? Oh, you your don't believe name? that his real name is Snake? Your name means nothing on the battlefield. How old are you? Old enough to know what death looks like. Any family? No, but I was raised by many people. Is there anyone you like? I've never been interested in anyone else's life. So you are all alone. Just like Mantis said. Other people just complicate my life. I don't like to get involved. He just likes to hit it and You're then quit it. You know how he man. rolls. Come on. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Can we uh conclude this episode now? I think so. Can we get can we get into our uh Oh shit, I gotta plug my controller back into fucking slot one. Hold on. Ugh.
don't want to accidentally like reset the game or kill my PS2. All right, we're good. So let's save it if I can. Um, let's talk to Mei Ling right quick. Yo, Mei Ling, what to do? The tongues of dying men enforce attention like deep harmony. Snake people don't normally lie with their dying breath. I think he was telling the Maybe truth. Maybe you should believe him. Maybe you should believe him. Believe him. Maybe I should. Maybe I shouldn't. I do what I want, Mei Ling. You can't tell me what to do. I believe what I want. Well, anyways. Please. Yeah, I won't give up. Don't worry about me, Mei Ling. Anyways, that was a fun episode. A hell of a fucking battle to record, but it was worth it. So, I guess next time on Let's Play Metal Gear Solid, we'll go through the secret passage and try to get to the Metal Gear, I guess. See you guys then. Peace.